Hello, hello, hello. How are you doing, Virgo? This is Positive Thoughts and Energy. How are y'all doing? This is your nighttime energy reading. Nighttime slash late night. Okay. I have to get up in the morning, so I have to, you know, get this to y'all now. I love you guys. How y'all doing, Virgo? How was your Thursday? How was your day? I hope you had a very stress-free day. I also hope you stay safe. To all of my beautiful Virgos, thank you for your beautiful likes and sharing my content. It means a lot to me, to new viewers, cross-watchers. Come on in, take what resonates. I need you to stay with me. There are lessons, blessings, and confirmations in my readings. Okay? So I need you to stay with me. Okay? So we're going to get started. We're going to tap into the energy, do your reading, and give you some affirmations towards the end. Okay? Okay? So let's see what spirit guides have for you, my beautiful souls. Spirit guides, I ask you for clarity, understanding. Most of all, I ask for your divine protection, okay? So this is for Virgo. So let's see what's going on with you, Virgo. Spirit guides, okay, my goodness, love. <coughs> love, sweetness. Mm, lollipop, lollipop, bloop, pop, the lollipop. Who like lollipops? Okay, well, you got sweetness here. Some of you are sweethearts. Some of you are definitely sweethearts. Maybe some of you are going to get sweetheart valentines. Some, something's coming up. You need some rest, Virgo. Some of you need some rest. Your little eyes are heavy. Okay, you need to get you some sleep. Okay, your little eyes are just heavy. Little pretty eyes. They're heavy, but you need some sleep. Okay? That's for somebody, not everybody. Take what resonate, reverse the roles, how they fit in your life. I don't know your life, okay? So we got two cards that came out down here. You got isolation here, and you have caution. Okay, let's see what this is all about. Some of you are feeling isolated. Some of you in a dark space. Is it because of love you're not getting no rest? What's going on here, Virgo? What's going on with you? Okay, you don't. somebody don't want something to end. Comfort. You got the death card in the reverse. You haven't got no rest because, oh, that's too many. Spirit guys, this, thank you. Oh, rejection. Oh, okay, Virgo. So I'm getting, I'm picking up some energy here. First card came out was your sweetness card. Then you got the rest. You need some rest. Your little, your little eyes are very sad. Okay, I feel like some of you have been crying about something that you don't want to be over. Okay. Uh, right now, you're in isolation, in a dark space. I, I feel the energy of depression that's kicking in. Um, you're in your comfort zone. You're isolated. Caution, rejection, something you was rejected from. It doesn't always necessarily mean that there's a male energy or female energy. It could be you was rejected from a promotion, from a job, from a situation uh, you were rejected from. Okay. Um. Let's see what the reading is talking about. We can get a little bit more info, okay? I feel like, um, yeah, you got, you got, uh, yeah, a lot of deception in here. Well, we're going to find out. Spirit guys, this is for Virgo. Tell me more for Virgo. Tell me more. Thank you. Tell me more. Let's see what we got. Oh, you got the Ten of Pentacles here, Virgo. You got the Ten of Pentacles here. Why were you rejected? <sighs> Something you was cautioned about. That, uh, uh, this caution is, um, uh, this rejection is clarifying by caution. It's something you was rejected about. But the Ten of Pentacles are here. It's here. Okay, so this could be someone that is not getting any rest, Virgo. Uh, this person could be in, uh, uh, ice, it could be in isolation, you know, in their own little bubble, their own comfort zone, because you got comfort clarifying the isolation, which that means that they're in their own space in isolation. And um, whoever this is, this person, this person don't want it to be over. Fell over here with the dev card. They don't want it to be over. They want longevity with you. This person wants to have it all with you. This person wants to share what they have with you. So if you rejected somebody, we've been talking about this lately, haven't we? Uh, Virgo, you rejected somebody because you felt a caution. You felt something. Uh, this person really wants to be in your life for life. Okay. They want everything with you. 
and they're in a dark place right now. They're not taking this very well. Yeah, told you. You got a Council Scorpio Pisces. Once you wants to, wants to. Uh, I feel like. Yeah, this person wants to return for a second chance, but they want to return and give you everything. They want the, they want everything with you. Okay, I feel like you got caution, you got rejection. I feel like something scared you, Virgo. I feel like something scared you and, you, and that made you reject this person. But I feel as though Spirit Guys is telling me it wasn't like that. Yeah, something they done, you, it scared you, it cautioned you. It's like it, it scared you and you rejected them. But uh, I feel like what Spirit Guys is telling me, I'm getting so many downloads that it wasn't like that. So something they done that scared you away. But they definitely coming in with the Ten of Pentacles, with the reverse, the Eight of, eight of Cups, Council Scorpio Pisces, and with the Death card in reverse that they don't want this to be over. So this person is taking this. This person really liked you a lot because you got the lot, you got the sweetness here. This person really has some love for you. They really, really liked you. It's like you were the type of, you were a person that they have not met in a long, long, long time. And they really gravitated towards you. And they really, really liked you, Virgo. But I feel like something they either said or something that they've done that really made you reject them out of the blue. And I feel like they just like, uh, what did, what did he do? What did she do? I don't know what it was. I don't know. I don't know your life, Virgo. Yeah. You went cold on them. You cut them off quick. You cut them off quick. Something they said, you said you, it's like, I don't know what they said to you, what they done. Uh, 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 uh spirit guys just keep it, the messages that's coming into my mind. Like it wasn't like that. That's all I keep hearing. It wasn't like that. They didn't mean it like that. That's what's spirit. Okay. They, they didn't mean it like that. So whatever they said, you, you, you went cold. You blocked them. You blocked them. It, it, it gave you a call. It's almost like, you know, that was a, a, it was like a red flag, but I feel as though what spirit guys is telling me Virgo, that this person didn't mean, mean it that way. Or, or this person, you know, uh, you, you took it out of content. Contact, contact, content. Yeah, you definitely went cold on this person. This person had a sweet, a soft spot for you. That's what Spirit Guys is showing me. This person had a soft spot for you. You know, um, you were different, but I don't know what they said, what they done, but it, you made the, it, they made you cut them off. I mean, without a second thought. And I feel like I'm, I hear you, Vir I hear you. I, my spirit hear you, Virgo. Well, they, they'll know the next time to make themselves very, very clear because I don't play that. I just heard somebody's energy. Well, they should have made themselves more clear because to me, that was a caution sign. Okay, so you, you cut this person off like a bad habit. You, and it, you, you, re you rejected them. And so... This is the person. I thought this was your energy, but this is the person that's in your energy. They're not sleeping well. They they in isolation, depression, because they really, really, really saw you as a sweetheart. Mm-hmm. Sweetheart. They haven't met, they hadn't met anyone like you in a very long time. But honey, you went cold. You went cold. You cut them, you, 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 you blocked them, you everything. You went cold. You yeah, I feel like, you know, with the Knight of Wands energy, it just came out. Now, in this situation, we're not talking about this person being a player. This situation, the Knight of Wands means that things are progressing. Things are progressing, you know, fast. That's what that also can mean. Depends on your reading. So I feel like I feel like what scared you. What this is telling me that spirit guys is down. I'm getting a download that this person scared you because they were moving too fast. That's what scared you. They were moving completely too fast. You know, I feel as though that this person must have started, you know, you hadn't even been talking to this person long and they wanted to put you on social media. You hadn't been talking to this person long and they wanted to, you know, uh, uh, meet their dog or meet their, their grandpa and 
or something like that. Whatever they done, it scared the living crap out of you. Uh, and, and it throw and, and to you it throwed up a caution flag. But I feel as though that I feel like this person was moving too fast. Because the Knight of Wands is, you know, that 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 change in energy. You know what I'm saying? That progressing, like, you know, things progressing very fast. Okay. Also, it's in and out energy. For some of you, they probably they thought they was gonna play that in and out energy with you. Maybe one day they call you and then you don't hear from them for two days, and then two days come and then they want to text you. And so you just blank, boom. I ain't got time for this, cut it off. You go get you go play with somebody else. But in reality, I feel like what they were telling you was really they now this is their energy, okay? What whatever they were telling you, he or she was telling you, he, he was telling you the truth. She was telling you the truth that, you know, they had to do this, this, da, 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 da. But I felt as though that I felt as though, I feel as though that you felt like this person was a player as well. OK. Ah, oh, that's a lot of energy. And so you went cold. You went cold because you felt you saw it. You felt there was a caution and you rejected this person. You call, I mean, you, 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 you blocked, you're not, you're not accepting in their phone calls. You blocked them on everything. I feel like this person have tried to, tried to find you on different social medias and uh, they can't find you. And they, they, they are really like, like a little poodle, like a little puffy dog. They are really, the eyes are, I thought this was your eyes, but this is their eyes. You know, they're not taking this, uh, taking this well at all. Um, because I feel like, um. Uh, this person may have made you felt like they were a player. Okay. Knight of Wands, which they're not. I feel like, I feel like uh, they're saying you took it out of content. That's what spirit guys keep, keep telling me in my spirit. Um, also for some of you, now for some of you, they say you took it out of content. For some of you, you felt as though that they was moving too fast. Okay. They were moving too fast. Like, you know, I ain't been knowing you but a week and you talking about, OK, where we going to who going to move? Who gonna, and, you know, if this was somebody from a distance that you was talking to, OK, who going to move first? OK, who's going to compromise and move to, you know, they was just talking too much when uh, when it's almost like you didn't even you know, we hadn't even got to know each other. You already talking about the mohill over the mountains, the mountain over the mohill. OK, so I felt like I feel like something something definitely uh, shuck your foundation where you, uh, definitely rejected them and went cold on them, Virgo. But they, uh, they're saying it's not like that. They want, they want longevity with you. They want everything with you. They want to share what they have with you. <sighs> My goodness. My good. Well, and Virgo say you need to make yourself very clear, but if this person was moving too fast, it's like, no, that's not a good sign. You move in completely too fast. And that's why the night of in, the night of wands. Some of you saying, um, no, he sound like, or she sound like she's a player. He's a player. And you, you, you nipped out in the bud before it even got started. And this person like, well, what happened? What happened? You know, um, I feel like this person, you got the patient card that came sideways. They was trying to be patient about the situation. It was trying to be understanding the patience is, uh, you know, trying to look at the situation, you know what I'm saying? It's like making it, it's like almost upset them. They was not really angry, but they was upset because they feel as though that you, they, you didn't give them a chance to uh, tell their side is what spirit guys is showing me. OK, so you got the patience in the, you know, sideways like anger. They kind of angry. They're not really mad, but they're like upset about it. And now they're in a dark space. OK, because they really liked you a lot. This person really liked you a lot and they wasn't uh, playing games, even though you got the Knight of Wands here. Some of them have that player energy, but I feel like they are a player player. I don't know what they said, whatever they said to a Virgo. I repeat, whatever they said to a Virgo, Virgo took it just like that, that you a player or you moving entirely too fast. And I feel like this person was just moving too fast and it and it just really it just bothered your energy because you're like, I am not. I am not you you're trying to push me out of my comfort zone and I don't even know you. That's what I feel like Virgo say, I don't even know you and you just trying to trying to really, you know, jump over the mohill and we haven't even <clears throat> we haven't even got to know each other. <clears throat> so I feel like this energy is that they were moving too fast. 
they were moving too fast and that made you go cold on them because it's like, what is really up with this person? What is their, what is their, um, intentions? You know what I'm saying? <sighs> yeah, my goodness. Tell me more. Could, like I said, it could be a Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, it could be a Sagittarius, it could be a, it could be an Earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Okay. Yeah. That part right there. Tell me more for Virgo. Woo. Y'all see that? Mm-hmm. Oh my goodness. Let me see what's going on here. Yeah, look here. Devil energy. This person's, yeah, this person is very, very attracted to you. Okay. This person could be a Capricorn. I intuitively see a Gemini. They're very attracted to you. The, 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 the devil energy. Okay. This is also someone that you, I feel like you felt that they were too, they were toxic. They were toxic and you, and you, um, I get the energy of pushy, pushy. They was too pushy, too pushy. Yeah. Look here. You got the, the chariot card and you got the six of cups here. Council Scorpio Pisces. They want to move too fast. You know, it's like they wanted to build Rome in a day. Yeah. That part right there. They wanted to build Rome in a day and they was attracted to you. It's like they never, like I told you in the beginning, they never met anyone like you. You are a sweetheart. They, and you know, ne you know, the heaven is like, you know, and, and sometimes people don't realize when you just moving so fast and you're not giving things time to just flow, um, you know, especially in the beginning when you haven't, you know, haven't known the person for about a week and they ready to go jump a broom. You know, some people be ready to go jump a broom. Are you crazy? I don't know you. So whatever they did, whatever you did cross watch it to this Virgo to make them reject you and go cold immediately on you is something is how you were acting that gave Virgo a flashback. Either you were moving too fast. This can be different situations for different people. Either the person was moving too fast, wanted things to progress very fast, like uh, let's get married tomorrow. Yeah, that type of thing. Uh, whether they were moving too fast or they gave you the in, uh, uh, initiative, uh, they gave you, uh, made you think that they were a player or they were toxic in some kind of way. Okay. They were toxic some kind of way. Whatever it was, you caught, you caught heed to it. Virgo caught heed to it and rejected them and went cold on them. See that? Hold that up. Yeah, you went cold on them. <sighs> but they say you took it the wrong. He, he or she say you took it out of content. Okay, yeah. yeah, definitely. This could be somebody that was younger than you. You were younger than them, but they were very immature. That's why Virgo rejected you. You were, you were playing too much. You got the page here. You got the page and you got the ones. You, they played too much. It's like they was just, you didn't like it. You didn't like how they was playing with you. They could have been kidding about something, but you didn't like the way they were kidding about something. But you took that mess serious. It's like, you know, you don't kid with me. You don't even know me like that. You should be trying to really, you know, be serious at this point in time. And this is them. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, you could have met. Oh, my goodness. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Look at here. Whew. My goodness goodness yeah the tower in reverse they're feeling this they are feeling this virgo yeah virgo say huh you won't play you won't play that that child no childish games with me so whatever they said to you whatever he said whatever she said he she patata potato tomato tomato how we go Oh yeah, they know they know they shouldn't have done that. They know they shouldn't have done that. They wish they could replay. They keep replaying this in their mind. Whatever he or she said to you. This is someone you started talking to. You started, you was this is a fresh, this is someone fresh that you was talking to, either from six days ago to six months ago. Okay, this is someone you was definitely from six to eight months ago. Yeah, you cut them off. You cut them off. Now they're feeling it. They're, they, yeah, they feeling this. It's like, oh, my God, I shouldn't have, you know. I don't know if they're trying to make themselves look good with this Knight of Wands or, you know, trying to, you know. But, see, you <laughs> you like your comfort zone. Don't be trying to come in and say you're ready to change something in my life when I don't even know you. I don't know you from a can of freaking sardines. So whatever they said, whatever they done, however they came off, Cause you to reject them very. Oh yeah, you you spotted the red flag very quickly, 
And this person is like, they are very, they really are attracted to you. Very attracted to all, everything about you. They're attracted to you, Virgo. And, <clears throat> and they don't want this chapter to be over. They got the death card. They want, they want long-term with you. They want a second chance. They want, they want to talk to you. They want a second chance. And you got here, you know, they were moving too fast. Virgo don't like that. I don't know who you are. Virgo don't like that. Mm -mm. I don't give a fat rat cat. Virgo don't like that. The Virgo do not like to be rushed. Don't like to be, you know, you got to ease a Virgo out of their comfort zone. You can't think you boom. I met you today and boom. Okay. We need to decide who going to move to whose town. We going to say who going to move to what in the fire hell is he talking about that she's talking about? Oh, no, no, no. You can't you can't move fast on Virgo. Virgo don't do no. Uh, Virgo likes a plan. Virgo likes to be in a plan. OK, Virgo, you you can't get Virgo to be jumping no jacks and jumping across a freaking field. Uh, -uh Virgo ain't doing it. No, get somebody else to do it because Virgo is not doing it. Virgo ain't doing it. I'm sorry. And so you said, I'm looking for something else. That is not it. Virgo said, that's not it. I'm single, I'm beautiful. I'm waiting and looking on something else to come. You say, oh no, that ain't it. That's not the good sign. That's not a good sign. So it's different energies in here. This person could have acted like they were uh, a player or they could have been progressing things too fast, wanting to wanting things to happen really fast, you know, and uh, it made you go cold on this person. And honey, they all, he is all, she is all. Yeah, you said I'm taking a new leap of faith somewhere else. This ain't the beginning for me. Yeah, you're going to what something successful. And that wasn't it. And this person, <clears throat> yeah, this person, look here. This is bad. Yeah, they definitely, they definitely have a big regret. This person, my goodness. Virgo, how long did you talk to this guy or this girl? Because it's a very short time. I'm seeing six weeks, six, uh, just a week ago, maybe six months ago <clears throat> that you talked to this person. And it's like you just talked to them for a few days and they was ready to progress very fast. Or they make they 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 uh, pull that they they, they 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 was pulling off an energy of player and you wasn't going for it. Oh, yeah. Yeah. You definitely went cold. You definitely went cold. Mm -hmm. See, they still have a crush on you. They still, the Council Scorpio Pisces, they have a crush on, they're still looking at your pictures. They must be doing it from a fake page, but they're definitely still, they have a crush on you. They like you. They still, this person, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm, mm, poor fella, poor woman. They're not happy at all, whoever you are. Yeah. Well, I tell you, if you're moving too fast, if you're trying to, you're trying to speed down Virgo, it ain't, it ain't going to happen. I'm telling you, it ain't going to happen with Virgos. Virgos are set signs virgos are grounded you got to ease virgo into what they want you can't think you coming into virgo's life and boom oh no virgo do not uh-uh <clears throat> if you want to run a virgo off do that act like you're playing a game <clears throat> act like you're moving too fast and you're talking too much or whatever you're doing you're doing too much they're gonna they're going to block you you, you going to be just as, it's just like you ain't never, you did, like they ain't never met you in their life. <clears throat> Thank you, spirit guys. Empathy. Exactly. Empath. <coughs> Excuse me, y'all. It says, I am open to seeing both sides of a situation. <coughs> Hold on, y'all. I don't know what that was. Uh, that, that uh, diffuser really brings out a lot of me. But you are empath. You can feel, you know, you feel, you feel a person's intentions. You understand what I'm saying? I'm open to seeing both sides of a situation. It's like, wait a minute now. You say, wait, hold, hold, hold a freaking minute. Because I know I ain't crazy. He, he or she moving too daggone fast. I, 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 you, I, I, you're talking about the wrong thing too soon. Okay, we ain't even crossed the line yet. We ain't even got to the <laughs> nothing, really. We ain't even went on the first date yet. We just talking on the phone. <clears throat> Spirit guys, what is the affirmation for Virgo? So yeah, you did. You sure did. 
pride. Pride. It says, I, I love I love myself and I see myself in everyone. I love myself and I see myself in everyone. Yeah, thank you, Spirit Guys. Regret. It says, I know that I cannot change the past. Bottom of the deck, envy. It says, I am the same as everybody, but with different challenges. So why are you being envious of me? But you got regret. I feel like this person is regretting that. However, the energy that they put off towards you, they're regretting that they did that. Whether they was talking too much, too fast about something too soon or whether they was playing, trying to prove or have that ego, that pride that, hey, they got women, they got men or whatever, whatever they done, whatever they done, you said, uh, I'm out of here. OK. Yeah, that part right there. Mm, 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 mm. Spirit guys, tell me more. I got uh, my other mystical journey cards. See what else is coming out for Virgo. Yeah, this person said they didn't mean it like that. Okay, Virgo. The way forward is open. It says you're not trapped. Possibilities and opportunities abound. I will guide you to your personal and spiritual freedom. Okay, so a lot of you, yeah, you going on on your own journey. You <laughs> you ain't even sticking around for this. You, you going on, taking a new leap of faith somewhere else. Okay, he said, uh, uh this person crazy. Ain't no way. What are we talking about marriage and we only been knowing each other for a week? Are you freaking crazy? What are you talking about? Let's uh start, let's do this together. Let's start. Who gonna move where? Don't, don't, don't you messing up with Virgo. I'm just telling somebody. Don't do that. Virgo don't like that. Virgo is already a fixed sign. Virgo is already a type that grounded, they like to be in their comfort zone, and you come a uh, day one. Talking about we get ready, uh, we, somebody got to move. Virgo said, no, we ain't. You going to move. You moving right the heck out of my life. Period. Yeah. Tell me more spirit, guys, for Virgo. What is it? What's the affirmation? Thank you. It says change is coming for some of you, for a lot of you. I am here to guide you through this exciting transformation. This is a um, time of joyous and opportunities. A lot of you got a change coming in. Uh, Virgo, <clears throat> tell me more, spirit guides. Tell me more for Virgos. Okay. It says, nope, it's not time yet. Something that you want to happen, Virgo? No, it's not time. It says, this is not the time. This is not the divine right time to take actions. Please be, please be patient. The opportune moment is approaching. Okay. So something that you want to happen now, Virgo, that's for a very small percentage of you. It's not time yet. And you have step into the spotlight. It's time for you to shine your light, Virgo. It says you have a message that the world needs to hear. It's time to shine. It's time to share your wisdom. OK, a lot of you are trying are being hesitant about stepping into your power. It's time to shine. OK, yeah. At the bottom of the deck, this is for somebody. It's time. Uh, yeah. For you to open up your gifts. OK, open up to your spiritual gifts. Remember that your that your true nature is spiritual, not physical. The angels are sending you messages to guide your soul's growth. OK, so that's definitely for somebody. So, Virgo, yeah, you said whatever they said, they said it wasn't like that. This person said it wasn't like that. They didn't mean it that that, that way. They were so excited because they hadn't had somebody like you and that you were sweetheart and that they was just really crazy crazy about you and and really liked you a lot they was attracted to everything about you but the thing about it is that they were moving too fast and Virgos earth sign Virgo Taurus Capricorn don't like when you move too fast and they talk they self right out of a good person that's what they done and they feeling it they feeling the wrath because they know they talk they self right out of a good person I am positive thoughts and energy until next time